बुलेटिन राइट ऑफ विथ सम ब्रेकिंग न्यूज कमिंग इन ऑन दैट सर्वे गोइंग ऑन ऑन द ज्ञान वापी कॉम्प्लेक्स नी एफ गॉट सम इन साइड स्कूप ऑन डे टू ऑफ ज्ञान वापी सर्वे दैट ए एस आई हैज डिवाइडेड इट्स टीम इन टू फाइव टीम्स एंड वन टीम विल कंडक्ट सर्वे ऑफ द वेस्टर्न वॉल अनदर टीम विल सर्वे द अंडर द सेंट्रल डोम एंड अ सेपरेट टीम हैज बीन फॉर्म टू सर्वे द पिलर्स एज वेल the fourth team will coordinate with all the aforementioned teams and additionally a new team has been established today for the soil testing as well so this is the big breaking news and a scoop on the day 2 of gyanwapi survey that asi has divided it into five teams and one team will conduct a survey of uh, the western wall another team will survey under the central dome Uh, a sent uh, a separate team has been formed uh, to survey the pillars as well the fourth team will coordinate with all the aforementioned teams and additionally a new team has been established today for the soil testing as well remember the supreme court on friday refused to put a stay on the survey of gyanwapi mosque by the archaeological survey of india and now the team has been divided into five subsections uh, we have some ground reports coming in let's take a look आज लगातार दूसरे दिन आर्कोलॉजिकल सर्वे ऑफ इंडिया के द्वारा ज्ञान मस्जिद परिसर का सर्वे लगातार जारी है मैं इस वक्त एंट्री पॉइंट पे मौजूद हूँ जहाँ पर बैरिकेटिंग की गई है और मेरे पीछे जो ये सीधे रास्ता देख पा रहे हैं ये ज्ञान मस्जिद की तरफ जा रही है आज भी देखिए हेवी डिप्लॉयमेंट है आप यहाँ पर देख सकते हैं उत्तर प्रदेश पुलिस के जवान यहाँ पर तैनात है और आज दूसरा दिन है जब ए की टीम सुबह नौ बजे से शाम पांच बजे तक लगातार सर्वे करेगी ज्ञान मस्जिद परिसर में उत्तर प्रदेश पुलिस के जवान यहां पर मौजूद हैं इसके बाद यह पहला लेयर है सिक्योरिटी का और अगर हम बात करें तो इसके बाद इसके बाद जो है पीएससी के जवान तैनात होंगे पैरामिलिट्री फोर्सेस के जवान तैनात होंगे और आज सबसे आखिरी में कमांडो फोर्सेस तैनात किए जाते हैं और आप वहां पर देखिए जो स्थानीय लोकल पुलिस की जो जिप्सी आप वहां पर देख पा रहे जो वैन वहां पर देख पा रहे वो लगातार पेट्रोलिंग कर रहे हैं क्योंकि काफी संवेदनशील मामला है ये ऐसे में उत्तर प्रदेश पुलिस और एल की यूनिट जो है लगातार इस पूरे इलाके में लगातार वो पेट्रोलिंग करती है ताकि किसी भी तरीके से लॉ एंड ऑर्डर सिचुएशन खराब ना हो पाए आई हैव न्यूज एटीन जसप्रीत पाल ज्वाइनिंग मी लाइव ऑन द ब्रॉडकास्ट जसप्रीत अ वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग टू यू जसप्रीत आई वॉन्ट टू अंडरस्टैंड वॉट्स द एनवायरमेंट लाइक देयर वॉट इज हैपनिंग ऑन द ग्राउंड ऑल्सो हाउ द ए एस आई टीम हैज बीन डिवाइडेड इन टू फाइव सब टीम एंड वॉट इज देयर रोल I will tell you the latest update. Today is the second day of the survey. The Archaeological Survey of India has begun the survey at 9 a.m. in the morning, and it will continue till 5 p.m. in the evening. I will show you the visuals. Uh, the Gyanwapi Mosque is 100 meters away from this site, and tight security arrangements are made because this is a very sensitive matter. And the update I will tell you that the Muslim side is also present in the survey. The Muslim lawyers are along with the Archaeological Survey of India team. Yesterday, the Muslim side has uh, has. Give the survey because they moved to the Supreme Court of India, and the biggest update is that the Muslim side is saying that they they are supporting the archaeological survey of India team so that they can complete the survey. Now you can see because uh, tight security arrangements are made, and the archaeological survey of India team is divided into five parts so that they can complete the survey as soon as possible. And the Hindu side is saying that they are appealing to the people so that uh, they can cooperate with the officials so that the survey can be completed as soon as possible. and you can see because this is a holy place and the people from different parts of the country come to this place to to the kashi vishnath temple and the tight security is made even the district administration is doing meeting with the officers and the archaeological survey of india team whatever support they are getting from the district administration but yesterday we have seen that the supreme court of india has said that they have rejected the muslim side plea and yesterday the muslim side was not with the archaeological survey of india team today the scientific scientific methods will be used the modern techniques will be used and uh, the archaeological survey of india India has assured the court that they will not damage the structure because the Muslim side was saying that the you know by doing the survey the structure will be damaged and at this point of time the survey cannot be done. The court said whatever the High Court has said in the judgment, the Supreme Court repeated the same thing that the survey can be done at any time and they have given the example of the survey when it was conducted during the Ram Mandir issue and I will show you the visuals my. my camera person nakul sharma is showing you the visuals and tight security is made uh, police officers are here uh, nsg commandos are here 
black commandos are here and the lawyers are also present in the Janwapi premises. Uh, the Muslim side which skipped the first day of survey is also taking part on the second day and as I am saying this is a sensitive matter so tight security arrangements are made, adequate security arrangements you can see and this is the way to the Gyanbapi complex and in view of the survey the security is very tight. This is the one way because earlier who have been to Kashi Vishwanath temple two wheelers were allowed from this way and uh, this the Gyanbapi complex is 100 meters away from this and the mobile phones are allowed the mobile phones are not allowed beyond this uh, barrier and this is the one way you can see this line the pilgrims from different parts of the country they are going to the Kashi Vishwanath temple from this lane and tight security arrangements are made and the survey will continue till one month it can go for uh, 15 to 20 days the archaeological survey of India team is doing the survey and the Hindu side is saying that they want to complete the survey as soon as possible and they want the people to cooperate so that they can work and today the update is that the archaeological survey of India team will work till 5 p.m. in the evening well, Jaspreet, you mentioned a very crucial point there that uh, no excavation would be there and modern techniques will be used uh, uh, while they are doing the survey. I want to understand from you that what modern techniques are they exactly going to use for the survey this time? Yeah, I will tell you DPR technique is used, even the carbon dating technique is used. Carbon dating technique is used to identify the age of the things. Because the Hindu side, as the Hindu side was saying in the court, uh, the walls are from the ancient time. It, it was from the before the 17th century when uh, Mug Mughal leader uh, Aurangzeb has demolished the Hindu temple and uh, uh, mosque was made. So the age will be determined at how old these uh, things are, the, uh, when the various things are found from the uh, Gyanmapi premises, as the Hindu side was claiming. So the truth will be revealed from this survey. Uh, the modern techniques, the GPR technology, basically these are the scientific methods. These are used so that the structure cannot be damaged. There will be no damage to the structure. And uh, you know, the uh, mapping is also done. Uh, the videography is done so that they can uh, these things can be used and these can be uh, given in a sealed envelope the report can will be given in a sealed envelope because yesterday the supreme court of india made it very clear to the hindu side to the archaeological survey of india team that whatever the report will become whatever will be the findings of the survey the findings should be in a sealed envelope and uh, the, yesterday also the district court has given the time to the archaeological survey of India team. Four weeks have been given. The time because there is no time limit from the Supreme Court of India. But they made it very clear the Muslim side plea is rejected. And whatever observations the High Court of India has given, the Supreme Court says the High Court has done a deep observation. And ASI has made it very clear that no damage will be done to the structure. I will show you the visuals. My camera person Nakul Sharma is showing you the visuals from ground zero. And you you can see the tight security is here, adequate arrangements are made so that uh, the survey can be done properly and today in 9 a.m. in the morning the survey has started. The Muslim side has approached the Supreme Court yesterday seeking a stay on the survey. The top court uh, allowed the ASI survey and today is the second day of the survey. The Supreme Court said that ASI has clarified that the entire survey would be completed without any excavation and without causing any damage to the structure because Muslim side, the, the, there was a question from the Muslim side that the structure will be damaged. So this is the main point and today the Muslim side is also along with the ASI team. Yesterday Muslim side has skipped the survey and we have seen even when the uh, district uh, court of Varanasi has made the judgment, the survey was done for more than five hours. Muslim side has skipped the survey. This is the first time Muslim side is attending the survey along with the archaeological survey of India team and the Muslim side is saying that they are cooperating with the ASI officers. So this is a big thing so that uh, the survey can be completed as soon as possible. Well, Jaspreet, I'll request you to please hold on because I have CNN News 18's Ananya Bhatnagar joining me on the phone line as well. Ananya, Jaspreet mentioned a very crucial point in this survey that Muslim side sort of skipped uh, uh, the survey yesterday but this is the third time they are present there for the survey. Do we have any word coming in from their side? What do they have to say about Supreme Court putting a stay uh, on the survey of Gyanwapi Mosque? 
Well, as actually, you know, very, very categorically, the Muslim side had issued a statement yesterday. The Anjuman Intazamiya Masjid Committee had very categorically stated that, you know, they will be supporting the survey that is happening at this point of time. Because remember that these are not orders from a Varanasi court. These are not orders from uh, a high court. These are orders at the topmost court of the country. This is an order that has been passed by, uh, in fact, the Chief Justice of India himself. And, and that's the reason why, in fact, they would be re um, respecting it. But uh, what, what is happening at the survey site? I, I'll, I'll take you through that as well. Uh, the teams are divided into basically four parts. Uh, number one, that would be at the central dome. The other team that would remain, uh, in fact, uh, at the northern and the southern side where the pillars exist. The third team would be uh, with regards to, you know, the western wall and uh, the Vyasji Khana. While, the, uh, while, you know, uh, the fourth team that is existing will be carrying out the soil tests and also uh, would be looking into, you know, uh, the GPR service that would be carried out at these four sites and would be coordinating and, uh, you know, coordinating the efforts of the all other teams. So very, very experienced, um, you know, officials from, in fact, the Archaeological Survey of India and those conducting the ground penetrating radar um, uh, exercise would be uh, the scientists from, uh, in fact, um, the, the people from the IIT Kanpur, one of the very prestigious uh, uh, technical university in the country. And these are people who had been having this experience for a very long time and very crucial survey to take place. But remember that the evidentiary value of this uh, uh, survey would remain only if the suit is maintainable in law but that is that is something that is that is a legal point but at the end of the day this survey would actually be, uh, you know unearth the truth of the Gyanvapi all questions answered whether this was a temple that existed um, uh, before and then Aurangzeb raised it and, and then, then built a mosque over it or whether we talk about you know uh, uh, the, the claim of the Hindu side uh, of the Muslim side that it was a mosque since its pre-inception so all these questions would be answered with this one survey that would be carried carried out a lot of politics also playing upon this matter we just uh, uh, saw a few uh, uh, almost a week ago that you know uh, UP chief minister yogi adityanath too said that uh, here uh, this is a site where you know the trishul exists and uh, there is a clear proof that it is it is a part of the hindu uh, you know it's a hindu structure that existed and then was raised by aurangzeb so definitely a very very crucial exercise being carried out at the gyanvapi site and uh, we'll have to wait and watch as to what are the outcomes of this but uh, it might take almost most weeks for the Archaeological Survey of India to actually conduct this particular uh, exercise that is um, that is uh, they've been tasked to do by, in fact, the Allahabad High Court and the orders have now been, uh, you know, stamped by the top first court of the country very, very clearly. Uh, yesterday, the bench headed by Justice um, uh, Chief Justice of India, D.Y. Chandrachur, along with Justice J.B. Partiwala and Manoj Mishra, very categorically stating that, you know, since the Allahabad High Court has taken care of all of the contention of the Muslim side, the major fear with regards to, you know, uh, that the destruction uh, of that particular structure or the damage to that particular structure would be caused. That has all been taken care of by the ASI by an undertaking that was given out before the Allahabad High Court. All of this, um, you know, boiled down to a point where the Supreme Court said that, yes, this survey is something that can be uh, gone away with. Remember that the Muslim side is constantly saying that, you know... And I would request you please hold on because we have some reactions coming in on the same. Let's listen in. जहां तक हमको खबर है कि हमारे विपक्ष अंजुमन इज्जिया में भी इस सर्वे में सहयोग करेंगे और सर्वे जब दूसरा दिन है प्रातत्व विभाग द्वारा सर्वे की जा रही है लोग सहयोग करें जल्दी सर्वे निपटा किया जाए देखिए कितने ज्यादा चलेगी इसका नियम यह बनाया गया है कि 9 बजे से लेकर के 12 बजे तक फिर ढाई बजे से लेकर के साढ़े चार बजे तक शायद सर्वे चलने वाली है देखिए भाई आज अचानक से नहीं आए हैं सुप्रीम कोर्ट के आदेश को देख करके आए हैं और आए हैं उनका सम्मान है स्वागत है अच्छी बात है सर्वे में सहयोग करें शांति में सहयोग हो जाए और एक बहुत बड़े मुद्दे का प्राक्षेप हो जाए मिली है और एक महीने तक सर्वे चलेगा और आज देखिए अगर मुसलमान भाई लोग सहयोग करेंगे तो हम तय खाने की भी जांच हो सकती है हाँ सब सब सामने आएगा सभी सनातनियों को बहुत बधाई देना चाहूंगी कल की जीत हम लोग की बहुत बड़ी ऐतिहासिक जीत है वो देखिए इसके लिए हमारे अधिवक्ता गण हरिशंकर जैन जी विष्णु जैन जी ने बड़ी कड़ी मेहनत की है बहुत कड़ी पर, कड़ी परिश्रम किया है कि महादेव ने हम लोग को आशीर्वाद दिया है अब सर्वे लगातार चलेगा जो सच बार बार छुपाया जा रहा था वो वैज्ञानिक पद्धति से होगा जीपीआर के जरिए होगा तो सारा सच सामने आ जाएगा जो हम लोग कह रहे थे वो खुल के अब सब सामने आना शुरू हो जाएगा